Hey, Chad here with Speed Addicts Fest Growing Gear site on the web, and today we're gonna uncreate the Icon Airform jacket. Before I jump in and tell you all about this Icon Airform jacket, go ahead and subscribe for me. That helps us keep bringing you the best gear reviews in the whole universe, of course. And if you decide you'd like to purchase some Icon gear from us here at Speed Addicts, well, hey, we'd appreciate that as well. There's a link in the description below to shop for this Airform jacket, as well as any other parts or gear you might need for your next two wheel adventure. So Icon, these are the crazy guys out of Portland, Oregon that make really stylish street gear. This is an interesting piece. This is essentially just a shell with armor that is waterproof. They even throw in a little hood. So interesting piece that is not super expensive coming in at right about 200 bucks. They have a few different colorways and uh, it's vented, it's comfortable. It gives you enough protection to get by as well as a little bit of protection from those elements. It is CE certified. All that means is that they pass the uh, safety standards in Europe. Here in the US, we don't have any safety standards for armor because, you know, America and stuff. Uh, but you do have that D3O armor in the elbows, shoulders, and back. As far as fit, most important part of the video, as everyone knows, you're gonna see sizing available from small up through 4X. So they have a pretty nice range. Now, I usually wear about a size large in most t-shirts. 44 inch chest, 62220. Now, <clears throat> this jacket fits me pretty good in a size large. If I would have gone by the icon sizing chart, it would have recommend, recommended a size extra large for a 44 inch chest. Now, I do notice the sleeves are just a t maybe a touch small, but I feel like the extra large would be baggy. So, so far all the icon jackets I've tried out just seem to run a little bit big. So I'd recommend round, rounding down about a half to a full size. Now, if you have worries about fit, don't worry, my friend. Here at Speed Addicts, we got you covered with no cost returns. All you have to do to qualify is number one, shop at Speed Addicts. Number two, live in lower 48 states. And number three, make sure the gear's in new original condition with all their original packaging and we'll get you a free return label. So return exchange, whatever you need to do, Speed Addicts will make sure to treat you like family. So give us a shot on your next gear purchase. Okay, enough with my shameless plugs. Let's check out the Airform in a little bit more detail. They're using a 420 denier uh, polyester chassis to make up the Airform. This stuff is abrasion resistant, but not the heaviest weight. This is relatively lightweight, but something that can get you around town and isn't super bulky. And of course it does have the armor, which we're gonna talk about more in a minute. So that is what the frame is made of and it is waterproofed, so it will keep you relatively dry there. So let's talk about the zippers. They're using YKK zippers, nice easy entry. As I open it up, you'll see that it's just kind of a mesh liner. It doesn't have a true liner, so this is kind of a shell. It's not gonna uh, provide a ton of warmth, so if it's cooler outside, you're gonna wanna wear your own base layer. There's no pockets on the inside, but there are exterior pockets. Now the zipper on this entry point is, uh, whoops, is beefy, it's just getting hung up there. The zipper on these pockets is pretty wimpy. The thing is tiny with gloves on. It's gonna be kind of a, a tough pull to find that guy and bring it down just a little nitpick there. But they do have these pockets on the front and you have ventilation up here. So I have the gussets open. You can see the mesh right through there. You can close these like so if you wanna seal it up. There are corresponding uh, exit vents on the back of this, which we'll also show you. And let's check out these cuffs. So they do have a vented cuff which means it has two zippers on it, not just one to make it easier to get in and out of the jacket, but you can do a reverse zip to get a little bit more airflow up the arms right there. So that's on both sides. You can just open that up if you wanna get a little bit more mesh airflow going through that guy. The hood that you see right here is stowable, which means there's a little piece of Velcro on the back here to roll this up and get it out of your way if you don't want a hood going around on the road. And then they also have these uh, elastic cinches to keep the elements out of the coat. Now, finally, let's talk a little bit more about the armor. You're gonna get D3O armor, which is a third party armor manufacturer. This stuff is really cool. It's lightweight, it's supple, it sits nice against your skin. You kind of hardly know it's there. The Magic D3O is once it's impacted, it gets a lot harder, stiffer, and absorbs the energy. This is the back protector that comes in the back of the Airform jacket here. And you're also gonna get elbow and shoulder cups uh, in each one of these jackets. Icon's gonna stand behind this coat for one year, make sure it's free of any sort of defects. 
If there's anything I forgot to cover here, don't worry, Speed Addicts are standing by at speedaddicts.com through email, live chat, and the phones. Or you can let us know how you like your jacket down in the comment section below. We appreciate y'all for watching. We'll see you next time to find out what's in the crate.